Hello, what's up? I'm Brian, you're doing another video for you guys, and this time we're going to take a look at another random Transformers reveal, and something that we didn't really know was coming, and I'm happy about it, mainly because I said on Twitter, you know, if they decide to do Legacy Rescue Bots characters, I I'd be totally fine with that. And then all of a sudden this shows up, and it's a Legacy Rescue Bots character. What are the odds? But uh, this is Medix, which isn't really one of the main leading rescue bots. I was kind of hoping for maybe Boulder or Chase or something else, but no. Medix, which is totally fine. At least they're trying to get into that, so I don't mind. And this is going to be a mainly a repaint of the Crankcase figure that's already been out. But it does have a couple of tweaks, and it actually reuses parts from other Transformers toys as like an amalgamation to make this thing. But just taking a look at the colors, first of all, I do like the white, although it does show a lot more of the panel lines, especially the transparent blue that's right beside the doors, which is a little unfortunate, but it's a nice bright color, especially for the bumper, which, by the way, does still transform into the gun if you want that. I also like the light green color scheme for the little lines on the side and then the top there. That's pretty cool. There's also a siren piece, which I'm not sure if it's a previously reused part, but considering that everything else has been reused, I would guess that maybe it's something from, let's say, Red Alert, or it, it looks much thicker than the one from Red Alert. I'm just using that for an example. Also, it's got the orange canisters on the side. I thought that was a nice touch. And uh, yeah, I, I like the bright colors for this, but what I'm confused by is that the head is the same one from the Burnout spoilers to the robot mode. And for Crankcase, I believe he needed a bigger panel over the head, so I'm not sure if that's going to mess with the design of this. You can see that kind of sinks in, and then there's also a gap there. By the way, a lot of people thought that this was a custom, but there seems to be three that are very similar to each other, which tells me that, no, this is a mass-produced figure. Anyways, moving on, we also have the back of the truck that I wanted to touch up on, which it's got some dark gray for the bumper, which is nice, and then black for the wheel over top there. I thought that was a nice touch. Also, you can see more of the gas cans right there. And then we take a look at the robot mode. Honestly, I thought this was downshift when I first saw it, but uh, no, it looks pretty good. I love the green on the torso that gets revealed once you pop off the gun, which, by the way, the guy has it plugged on the back for storage, but you can leave it on the chest. I might do that because, you know, if I want to get crankcase and this, maybe I can make some sort of difference to that. But that does hide a lot of the orange and green in that, and I think that complements it well. I think that the burnout head does look nice for the robot form, especially with the green over top there, and then the mouth plate, that looks nice. And, uh, yeah, it's basically just a white repaint of the crankcase. Now, not only that, you do get a couple of energized weapons that look like the Energon stuff from the, well, Energon line. But I believe it's a reference to some of the Rescue Bot weapons that also had transparent weapons. But you get the typical skids, crankcase, weapon in blue, but you also have the Elite of One guns in transparent orange. So I thought that was a nice touch. But that also tells me that this isn't going to be just a regular retail figure. Maybe it's going to be the next Walgreens exclusive. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But I haven't seen anything for this on any regular listing, so I would imagine that it's going to be some sort of exclusive. And for Walgreens, usually they have the medics for that, so it would make a lot of sense if, uh, in this case, they decide to use medics for that exclusive figure. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Anyways, with that said, I thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all those fun doodads. And I will see you guys next time. All Spark TV. Now that's just Prime.